I'm good guys. Welcome to Noble Creative Digital Marketing Agency. Hope you guys are doing great and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's tutorial, I'll be teaching you how to design an ebook cover without wasting much of our time. So the next thing we're going to do right now is we change the cover um the image size to 700 over 1000. So we change this one to 700. Good. 700. Good. Then change this one to 1000. Good. So you click on done, you click on okay. So you can see that the image size have changed. So that is the uh, image size for an ebook cover. So that's with much of a time. You click on your color layer, then you change this color to white color. So let's go to white color. So after that, the next thing we're going to do right now is to bring out the image that I use. So I use this image. Good. Then you place it down here. You should just place it down here. Then you click on your layer and you lock it. So after that, you click on the plus button again. You bring out this image. Good, this good. Then you actually rotate it, rotate it. Then you place it here. You see so it. So after that, you um you lock it too. So after that, you click on this uh, on plus button again. Then you bring out. You bring out this one. Um, I'm, I, I remove it from Canva, so let's go back to Canva. So, cool. so this is the image. So actually, this one we're going to edit a little bit first. I'm going to edit because we don't need it right now. So after that, the next thing we're going to do right now is to write the text. Um, this is going to be a sharp, a sharp, um, a very sharp, sharp tutorial because we are cutting. So change it to capital letter. Then you go to your font, then you change the font to something bold because WhatsApp font is something bold. So you actually use Montessara Black. Montessara Black. Ah, good. So after that, just place it here. And after you place it finish, just click on your color. Then you change it to this color. Actually, this color. So this is the color code. In case you want the color code. So this is the color code. Um, 0B. Sorry, 0 8 BD20 08BD20. So that is the color code code. So after that, you're done. You come back. You actually place it at the middle. Just go to your relative size. Place the position on me. Then you place it at the middle. Good. So that's in the middle. So the next thing we're going to do right now. Actually, it's big. It's big. It's big. So I'm going to release it a little bit. It's actually big. Good. So place it at the middle. A back. Place the position. Good. So you actually okay like this. So the next thing to do right now is to click on this test again. Then you write marketing. So you are writing marketing now. Um, WhatsApp marketing. Change to capital letter or scroll. So you change to capital letter. You go to your phone. Then you give you something light color. On the seven board. Seven board. Montessori seven. Probably seven the other. Yeah, actually same thing. So you give you Montessori. Yeah, Montessori seven board. It it is a one family front. They have to make sure they are aligned together. So let's go. Make sure they align together. Good. Then you change it to another color, which I'll be showing you right there. So this is the color that I'm using. So I'm um, this is the color code DF9F61. I come again DF9F61. So that is the color code for this. So can you see it now? So after that, you copy this marketing again. You duplicate this marketing. Then you write secret. Secret. Good. So that you place it here. You actually decrease it a little bit. You place it here. You just make sure they are aligned together too. Good. So after that, you go to your um to your spacing. This spacing you go to. Then you increase the space. Card. So can you see right now? So you move down a little bit. So I want it to be aligned together. So can you see it now? So can you see that it is aligned? What's our marketing secret? What's up, marketing secret? So this I want to do right now. So we'll click on your ship. Then you do this. You actually give something like this. Good. So you give it this color back. I think this color. I'm using this color. Okay, this color is good. So you click on it. So this I'm going to do right. So the next thing you're going to do right now is to click on this marketing. Then you click on duplicate. Then you write this. What I'm going to write right now. So you write this strategies. Good. So you go to your size and reduce the size. Good. 
So after that, change it to white color. Change it to white color. Good. So after you change it to white color, you can actually actually lock this. Then you create this one. After you increase it, then you go to your align. I'm um, align, align, align. So you so you click on the one at the middle. Good. Then you okay it. Then you okay. It comes to it and put it here. So you can actually see it right now. So make sure it's at the middle. So you go to your little position. Then you please, can you see it now? So it's at the middle. Good. So the next I'm going to do right now is to bring out this image that we use. This image that we eat. So you actually bring it down here into it. So after that, I'm just let me put something like the come money to it. So let's find money. So to me, no, um, a lot of people love money, so they actually go for money. So um, this I don't, I don't like this kind of money. So you click on this money. After you click on the money, just rotate it. Um, rotate. So where's the rotation? Okay, good. Just rotate it. Just rotate it. Oh, I don't like to use this kind of this kind of okay. I don't want the black thing to show. I don't want the black thing to show. It's a ton of I need only the dollar to show. Good. Good. So can you see right now? So we are so we are done, so we are good to go. So after that you now write you now copy this WhatsApp. Then you write the name of the person that owns the ebook. So I wrote to Alamele Good. Then you can actually decrease it. So decrease it. But this thing is big or is because I just I turn it off. If I turn it upside down, if I should I should do it the normal way, you will see how big this is. Actually big, but you might not know that. Size, so let me give you something. Good. So, you make sure it's at the middle. It's good. So, um, there's a challenge here yeah. that O is not showing very well. So, I'm going to click on this and adjust this a little bit. Yes, I tell you, I've got this one a little bit so that the other milk can good. The one knows something is happening over there. So, after that, the next thing we're going to do right now is to save your work, save your image. Sorry, save it as in PNG and as very high. So, this is how to design an able cover on your smartphone and in Pixel Lab. So, the next thing we're going to do right now is to mark it up. So, let's go to photobee.com. <laughs> yeah, good day, guys. Welcome back to photobee.com. So this is place you are using to mock up the design. So the very first thing you have to click on is click on your file you are seeing on the right hand side. Then you click on open. So after you click on open, it will actually show you this. Then you go to wherever your image is. So I have my image in my G home. So you click on it, then you click on wherever your home. Good. So can you see this one ebook here? Ebook cover when you are seeing up. There's another one, this two layer here. So we are actually using actually using this one. But in case you are doing you are doing only one um one one face, like the one we are doing, you use the framework up here. You use something like this, or you use something like not you are seeing under here. So we are using this one. Cool. So let's click on it. So you have to wait for it to load. So let's wait for it to load. So can you guys see that it has loaded? So the first, so the next thing you're going to press now is this layer, the, this layer. So you click on the layer, not this one you are seeing at the right hand side, but you are seeing at the, left, at the right hand side that I um circled. So you click on the layer. So you can see first double click, back double click, and we are spinning. The spin is what is at the middle. So the back is at what is at the um the left hand side, while this front is at the what is at the right hand side. So we are using only the the front. So we are going to cut out the um 
the um the, the left later on so you click on this you click on this you click on this double tap it so you double tap it so can you see so after you double tap it just click on this eye everything just click on it click on it so can you see now you have transparent so we have only transparent so after that you click on your file again then you click on open and place so after you click on open and place you click on file then you go back to your image and that is your pixel lab the one we just did right now so this is it so you click on it it will actually load because so you can see that's loaded so i'm coming let me make it cool so can you see right now so you have to adjust it to so adjust it cool. adjust it Cool. So you can see now that we have adjusted it. So now, so the next thing that you are going to click on is click on the file again. Then you click on save smart object. So let us wait for you to save as smart object. Good. So it has saved as smart object. So the next thing you are going to click on is this PSD file here. And the other, so just click on it. Don't click on the um on, on the something like X on the cancel. Just click on it. It will actually show. So can you see right now? So the next thing I'm going to do now is to do the um the um the um the, the spin so you go to your spin then you double tap it again so you click on this eye so you eat everything so can you see it not right now so you click on your file again then you click on the open and place although the work of spin is just write the name of the person doing the um uh, the name of the person um like um the the name of the person that owns the book but because of our time I won't be doing that so just click on this one again then just adjust it just to, to fit in everything good so after it's fit in everything so you click on your file again then you click on save smart object so go so you are going ah, yeah so after you click on save smart object you click on the PSD file so you can see right now so the next thing now is to go to your background and this you are seeing background here so you click on it you click on the eye to hear the background so you click on it so you can see right now so after you click on it Although we can't eat the um the um the this side we can't eat it if not i would have eat it but that's not the case we're going to do and that work in pixel lab right now so after that you click your file again then you go to your export as png so you have to wait for it to load so we have to wait for it to load good so the the here is saved so you click on the save so it will download good so it has downloaded as a png file so the next thing now we're going to do right now is to go to your um see your um, all the colleagues to your pixel lab so let's go back to pixel lab so guys welcome to pixel lab but it will, we won't be using the uh, we won't be using this of uh, this actual uh, what they call it this actual size for the mockup so just click on the remote you can delete this one then we are doing two more copy here. Yeah, we are going to do two more cup. So the next thing we're going to do right now is to change the background color to any color of your choice. You can change it to white color. You can change it to this. So let me set color as an example and let's go in. So after you change it to white color, you click on your plus button. You go to your gallery. Then you click on the one you just downloaded right now, and this is it. So you know we are using only two sides. So just click. Just um, just zoom it. Just zoom it. Good. good so can you see right now good so if you put it here you're going to show this so you can see the book right now so there's nothing to give it shadow again just you can actually write so you have to mark it up like this so you actually click on your save or um yeah as click on your save save it as png and very high so another one is you can actually change this uh, the color to another color so can you see right now so this is another color you can actually give it another color so this uh green is also um it's also gold it's also in a fine color so after that i'll be showing you another mock-up that you can actually use to do it so after that you just click on this you um eat this you want you eat it so after you eat it you go to your clarity then uh, this is what i show you guys right now so you can actually choose any one of these so let me say i choose this one to do it so you just click on this then after that you go to your relative size you click on your relative size then increase this one put 100 100 good so you, you be the one to actually do it like this good oh. so i will drag it like this so after that after you drag it finish you can actually lock it so after you lock it you drag this one to the upside 
people then you actually do this to it so after that you click on it again then go to your cropping to crop out the you go back to your cropping you also the cropping 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 so you go back to your crop you crop out this one out crop this one out good so after you crop it out you just place it on top you have to find it way you have to place it on top way so you can see they actually see it you place it on top so this is how i do this right now so this is actually how i did it so um so this is how to smack up the book and this is how to how to design an inbook on um pizza lab and also on photo page to market up so if you are new here don't forget to subscribe to the channel and don't forget to to have to like the video and don't forget to comment and don't forget to hit the bell icon to also be getting more updates from here thank you for your time thank you for watching up to now thank you about the way you look when you